Hey guys, it's SD, your host of the Life Fix Relationship Podcast, where people with all sorts of backgrounds, challenges, and life experience show us how they make their relationship extraordinary. Hey Life Fixers, hope you're having an awesome day and taking your relationship to the next level. Are you loving these Marriage Picks episodes? I am, and I hope you are too. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you have any questions, if you have any topic requests, go to lifepicksrelationships.com and on the podcast page, there's a place for you just to go ahead and put all your comments right there. Questions, requests, guests, anything I want to hear so I can go and give them to you. Now, I have some exciting news to go and tell you. And this is big. We need your help for this. It's not just going going to go and happen by itself. And that is we want rather we know that by the end of 2025, the Life Picks Relationship podcast will have 1 million dan- download, 1 million downloads or more per episode. Can you help us with this? Share this with your family, friends. Share Can you help us with this? Share this with your family and friends and help them take their relationship to the next level while helping us grow our podcast to 1 million downloads so that way more people can have an extraordinary relationship because anyone who puts in the work deserves an extraordinary relationship. Now, for today's podcast, marriage picks, three marriage picks. The very first one is appreciating what you have now. And at the same time, thinking about the future. As Mara was saying about her body, she knows that it's not going to last her forever. And she's not going to be able to have this job forever and be able to do this for her whole life. And so she's enjoying and making the most of every single moment that she has this ability and capability to go and push herself really far. And at the same time, she's saving money. She's thinking about the future and she is not being ignorant and saying, oh, this is going to be all beautiful and da, da, da. No. So it's about appreciating what you have now and thinking about what is going to be so you don't have those major surprises that really aren't surprises because we all know we're all going to get old. And so it's a balance. We're not being worried about it. We're just being prepared for it. Now, for our second marriage picks, I think this is so important. You know how much I talk about this. And these people are just a proof of it. You do you. You do what you are best at. Don't listen to other people. Just like do transcend got flat out nose because they listen to other people instead of doing what they are good at. And then when they decided to go push themselves, do what they know they are at best, they went and made it to the top 10 finalists and then first placed runner up in 2020. It just doesn't happen by itself. And it doesn't happen by you listening to someone else because if, someone else is telling you to do something that's not you. That's coming from someone else. And you know yourself best. And it's really hard because we get so many noises. And it's really hard because there's so much noise out there. There's so much people telling us things to do, whether it's social media, our parents, schools, teachers, just society. No one even has to tell you anything. And you get these messages of what you're meant to do, what you're meant to say. Forget it all. You do you and make the most of your life here on earth. Now for our very third marriage picks, never, ever, 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 ever give up on your dreams. I think Do Transcend is a fantastic example of it. When you hear flat out no's from EGTV's judges, you're like, okay, that's it. I can't do this anymore. I need to go find something else. I need to go do something else. Everyone telling me no. Mm -mm. Well, They proved the world wrong and you can prove the world wrong too, especially if the people that told you no are just your neighbors, friends, or parents who probably are wishing they could do what you are doing. Yeah. Yeah. Let that sink in for a minute. Okay. Never, ever, ever give up. Have a fantastic rest of your day. Crush it. And I'll see you on the next episode. Bye now.
Did you enjoy that episode? Could you do me a personal favor and subscribe and leave a review? It would mean a lot to me. Thank you so much and have an awesome day.